in case anybody wants to know what we're doing, uh, we are recreating the car vinyl 45 uh, that was put out by Chris Stamey on uh, Chris Bell's solo music. Uh, I am the Cosmos on one side and uh, you and your sister on the other side and we're recreating those for uh, the reissue of the Chris Bell Cosmos uh, uh, album. So uh, basically we're uh, we did the original vinyl masters, which are long gone, back in 1978. And so we're, it's it's kind of a time capsule journey, at least for Larry and me. And, and uh, uh, you know, it's uh, kind of ironic too that the 45 was the only uh, uh, music of Chris's that got uh, uh, issued before his uh, death at the end of '78. Kind of, kind of special content for us. Cut. <laughs> Beautiful. Isn't that something? Yeah, let me let me put this other yeah. eyepiece on. How do it know, John? Just how do it know? It's a miracle of modern science. What does it do? It makes the grooves fatter when it Well look, look it's right, going look right here. It's going this way at the same time as like that way. Yeah. You, you look at the two right in the middle. Vertical and lateral. And, and focus <clears throat> it for your eye with that big knob. Okay? You see the two right in the middle that come up and just kiss. almost touch. Just kiss. Mm -hmm. But don't overcut. Mm -hmm. I mean, if, if those two actually ran into each other, you would have an unplayable disc. Right. <laughs> so basically... It's just, you know, it's a preview computer that makes the most efficient use of space on the disk possible. He's inscribing the matrix number on the disk, which identifies uh, what the recording is and whether it's the A side or the B side to the pressing plant. Uh, without having that information every master looks pretty much the same and so that cuts down on the risk of the pressing the wrong thing or reversing the you didn't you need to read it read it out or just want to make sure I get it right. We are gonna put an extra thing on uh, on the other side. Okay. We're gonna put prudence. Okay. Guess why Guess who Prudence was? That's a cat. Yep, Chris Bell's cat. Yep. Dear Prudence, can you come out to play? Cat's name from came from Beetle lyrics. So. This was released before. Uh, yeah, a guy named Chris Stamey had a little independent label called Car Records up in North Carolina, I think, and he just put out. Pressed 45, and um, the Cosmos thing was mixed in air in London by Jeff Emmer. And, and th this one's my recording on this side. Uh, you beat him, John. Well, cats of two different cats of different natures. Uh, 